down. All right, Jordan's guarding me, arms length away. I don't, I, a lot of you have a tendency to take a huge step forward. All right, you gotta have the option to keep space. Now I can drive, I can change direction, I can step into space and shoot, and I can pass. Does that make sense? So you're keeping space rather than claiming space. So now your left hand, you're here every second dribble, one, two. We split, we engage here, shoulder shape, back square. So I'm one, two, drop, one, two, drop, one, two, drop, one, two, drop, get in the ball. So I hit every time, but we're keeping space. Left hand, ready. Right, go, work, free shoulder, go. Left foot forward, left foot forward. Every second dribble now, we're one, two, we split. This is our action. We're gonna take a cross step with our left foot across our frame. One dribble, left, right, open back up and play. But you're all stopping one, two. That's a speed stop. All right, so I'm keeping space and I'm, then I'm driving into space. So we're here, drop, left, right. We turn it around, go it again. One, two, drop, left, right. Every time, watch our left hand. We're engaging at the time, working on using that arm bar. Right hand, ready. Go, work, quick! Not real. You don't play basketball by pushing the ball in front of your body. All right, the ball lives with you. So when me and Jay are up with our left hand, we're here. We take this inside foot across our frame. It's ball foot. Now I have options. The ball is with me. I can pull. I can pass. I can change direction. So if the defense reaches behind, you can push it out. If you're in the front court and you blow by, you can push the ball out in front of you. But the majority of the time, when the defense is here, you're most likely not going to throw the ball in front. So when we drop, split. Punch the ball down, punch, punch, and then relax. So we're here, one, two, drop, punch, one, two. One, two, drop, punch, one, two. So we're the foot. Last one, ready? Go, work, three.
teachers are preaching, it's telling you to look up, look up, look up. Of course, we look up, we see the floor. When you work on skill work, if you're not sure about what your feet are doing, there's moments where you have to understand your feet. So right now, for the first couple reps, make sure you can look down, make sure your feet are correct. Once you understand your body and you understand your feet, then get your eyes up. So I can be here at the beginning because I'm focusing on my feet and then I'm up. Pop, pop, flip, flip, flip. All right, understand your feet. Left foot, forward, left hand dribble. Ready? Go!
Last one, now, Jerron, go with me. Come here, now. A lot of times in these situations, when we drive right hand, I'm bringing my left foot across my frame. So if Jerron's on my hip and I'm driving here, here, if he begins to cut my inside leg off, all right, a lot of players are here, cut my inside leg, boom, they're here, a lot of players either bounce the dribble or they pick it up and look to pass. So in order to have an option out of that as I drive, he cuts that inside foot off, one, two, I want to be able to punch that lead foot. All right, so that's a punch drag. So again, you can no longer step across your frame. I want to keep my options open. I'm one, two, I punch my dribble, and then I have some space. Okay, two dribbles, one, two, quick lift. One, two, lift, split. Inside, outside, so I'm stepping left, right. Two dribbles, left, right. That's my punch, because defense is inside my frame and then I'll bring the ball back. One, two, lift, hit, back, right, and then bounce back. One, two, lift, back, right, and then bounce back. Ready? Go, work. Those are the small details you guys are going to need to find success, all right? Those are the small details you guys are going to need to find success. You guys are here right now. If you're always doing a great job in your workouts, if you look good, if you leave your workout, like, man, I had a great workout. That's a problem. You need to be mistake-driven when you're working out, all right? During the season, that's a different time. You're working on maintenance. You're getting game reps. After the season, that's when you're focused on your weaknesses. You're working on uh, are improving for the next year, all right? So those little details, being mistake driven, are gonna separate you guys from everybody else. Got it? Any questions? We got stations, so get a drink and let's get back after. Hands up. All word by three, loud, man. One, two, three. All word. Told y'all I was gonna demonstrate that.